Hello there, children. How are you today? Welcome to another fun learning with. <laughs> Last time we had learned about the living things. Can you still remember the characteristics that I've taught you? Yeah. Let's see if you can still remember. Living things, what? Yes, living things move on their own. What else? Living things grow. Living things breathe. Living things eat. Living things reproduce. These are the different characteristics of living things, kids. Always remember that living things means things with life. Now let's go to the non-living things. You say non-living things, meaning the things around you that do not have life. Now let's see. There are two sets or two kinds of non-living things. The first one are the non-living things that God made. Whoops. God made a lot of things and some of those are the non-living things. Let's take a look at some examples. I have here the sun. When you look up there in the sky, you will see the sun as if it's moving. But children, always remember that it is non-living thing. It doesn't have life. Okay, how about the moon? How about the stars? They look like things with life, but they don't have. They look twinkling at night. They don't have life. These are called non-living things. Yes, you can see kids. Sun, moon, and stars are examples of non-living things that were made by God. I have here some more examples like the yes, volcano and even the rocks and the water. We call them non-living things. Now, if they are non-living things, how about non-living things that were man-made? or made by men. These are some examples. One, we have here the house. We are living in a house. You think the house is breathing? Does it move on its own? Does it have life? Of course, no. So our house is considered a non-living thing. Another example is a table. Okay, we are using a table a lot of times, but this is a non-living thing. Another one is a ball. This is a kind of toy and this is a non-living thing. How about an airplane? An airplane that can fly, but oops, that is flying because of an engine and gas, of course. That is a non-living thing. Let us go back to the different characteristics of non-living things that we had discussed. Non-living things... Don't move. Non-living things grow? No, they don't grow. Non-living things don't breathe. Non-living things don't eat. Of course, they won't eat. Kids, do you think about the pencil that you're using or you're holding now? Do you think that pencil needs food? Do you think that pencil will grow tomorrow? Of course, no, because that is a non-living thing. And non-living things don't reproduce. If you have one notebook today, that notebook will stay one tomorrow. That will not become two, three, or more. Because that will not give birth, of course. That is non-living thing. Okay, so now let's see. I have your examples or pictures Okay, let me read the direction. Write L for living thing and NL for non-living thing. Number one, a tree. Do you think it's a living thing? L or NL? Yes, it's an L. A tree is an example of a living thing. How about the next picture? A girl. A girl just like some of you. L or NL? Of course, it's an L, another living thing or another living being. You are all living beings, children, remember that. Next, number three, let's have balloons. Do you think balloons are living things or non-living things? Of course, it's NL, non-living things. Great job. How about number four? Mm, let's have here toys. 
Mmm, your favorite toys. Living or non-living? It's non-living thing. Very good. How about the last picture here? A bird. Living or non-living? Yes, it's a living thing. Great. Very good, children. So you all did a great job. And I'm giving you more stars. Oh, children, I hope that you have learned about the lesson that we had today. And I hope that it's clear with you that living things are things with life, while non-living things are things that don't have life. And always remember the characteristics that I've taught you. So the next time around, as you look around you, you will know if the object that you can see is a living or non-living thing. Thank you so much for today. See you again next time. Bye! God bless you! Love.